Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Abby with Abby Reviews. Uh, today is just going to be a quick unboxing. Um, I ordered some things from ColourPop. So it's going to be like a little mini haul. And uh, honestly, besides the uh-oh, the uh-huh honey palette, I can't remember exactly what I ordered because it's been a couple weeks. But we will see. Oh, this is cute. Okay, so... On the inside of the box, which I think is adorable, it says, Color Pop, your summertime find. <laughs> I gotta get my life together. All right. So, I got something. Zoella. I don't know what this is. Honestly, I have to look. There's one, two, three, four. And the palette. Yeah. And, oh, and there's something else in here. Okay. No, I honestly, I don't remember what it is that I purchased. Um, but yeah, we're going to see it. And um, so, start here. Let me see. I guess I got to see myself. Focus on me. Baby, can you focus on me, baby? Um, so this is the Aha uh -huh Honey Pressed Powder Palette. So we and I bought this because I have been dying to do a yellow eye look, but none of the yellows that I currently own, I have been satisfied with how it trying to make a like a monochromatic yellow look happen. So, gonna I'll leave that on for now. Take this off. Ooh, and this is what she looks like. Okay. I feel like she's kind of blown out. Let's see. Let's see if I turn this light off. Does that make it any better? Baby, can you focus? Does that make it any better? Maybe? On me baby okay so it's a nine pan palette it has a chunky glitter looks like one two three set foily satiny shimmer shades and then one two three four five mattes so i think um i can't wait to do a look with this i have a yellow sundress I don't think I'm going to wear the, the yellow. I don't know. I feel like I need a bright white t-shirt and maybe some jeans. And then do a popping yellow eye look. Oh, I guess we should do swatches. Hmm, let me get my life together. I'm going to do them on the palm of my hand. There's nine shadow shades. Then we'll put them on the palm of my hand. Because you can actually see my palm when I turn it towards the camera. Unlike my fat arm. So... Um, let's start here. Ooh. Let's do that one again. Baby, can you focus? Oh, that looks a little chunky and crumbly. Hmm. But pretty. Um, so this is the first row. Um, so from top to bottom, it is Sweet Spot, Sunburst, and Stinger. Like, I feel like you can't see this. I feel like this defeats the purpose. They're very pretty. <laughs> if you can actually see them. Um, I'm going to do... Look, I can fall out. What's that? Queen B. Ooh, I like that one. And this is the chunky um, gold one. Ooh, ooh. Get back in the pan. Palooza is what this one is called. Oh, that's super chunky. Okay. Grr. Grr. Baby, can you focus on me? And this is dan this is called dandy so from 
left to right. <laughs> I don't know. God, I feel like it's so blown out. Can you see it? Oh, there we go. So it is Palooza is the chunky one in the middle to the far left is Queen Bee and on the far right is Dandy. And I got three more to go. Okay. Baby, can you focus? I'm gonna gain because that one is not really showing up on my. This is gonna be my transition color, I can tell. Baby, can you focus? Me. Swatches are not normally the best to go by. It's best to see how they perform on the eye and on the brush. But, and you can now see the issues that I have. And those are the final three. Um, at the top is Buzzkill. In the middle is Oh Behave. And on the bottom is Totally Bugging. That's Totally Bugging down there. So you can see they're gorgeous. And um, I can't wait to play in these and see if I can't come up with something super spectacular. Now, this palette, it's not but $12. That's why I like them so much. It's because it was $12 and like 50 cents. Baby, can you? This is a lip crayon. Did I order a lip crayon? Okay, so I ordered a lippy tint in Treasure Island. Now this one I might actually be able to try on because currently the day has taken off my lip. And so this color. Oh, oh, it's like a jumbo crayon. So this is the color. I'm gonna swatch it on the back of my hand. Oh, I like that, I like that. Oh, uh, oh, I, oh, I know the smell. It brings back very fond memories. Oh, I like this. Okay. And it goes with what's left of my eye color. A sweet, fruit punchy, pineapple-y, fruity smell. It's very pleasant. I like it. I like her a lot. This is a winner. Okay. So that is the lippy tint. Um, okay. And there's something else orange. What is this? This is uh, the shadow. It's a, a sh liquid shadow in flavor, in shade OG. The Zoella cream shadow. No, supernova. Supernova shadow is what it's called. All right, so I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna put a little. Oh, that's pretty. That's what, that's what that looks like. It's like a, it's a pinky rosy gold color. She's gorgeous, I like her. Also a winner, does this smell like anything? No, no it does not. <laughs> okay, so we got two things left. All right, so. Because I had such a issue, I have such issues because, of course, my skin tone and yellow. It's not really a match made in heaven. Yellow, it's really hard to get like lighter colors to show up on me. I got the no filter foundation, not foundation concealer, in Fair Zero Zero, which is like a stark white. It's like a white. And I'm going to use this as my eyeshadow base for whatever look I do. 
so I'm gonna get this on my eyelids and blend that in see how stark white that is so that when I lay the shadows when I, I'm sorry ADHD when I lay the shadows on top of this once it's blended out onto my eye that'll make for a better base so uh, well, it's now brown because I have foundation on this sponge but y'all get the picture of what I'm going for with this and I bought this specifically for that reason because I think the issue that I was having it may not have been the other eyeshadows that were the issue it was maybe my skin tone and the fact that what I'm using as the base for my eye wasn't light enough. So, I got that. And last, but certainly not least, this is the Cream Gel Liner in No Shame is the name of the color. So, I wanted to try their eyeliners for my waterline. Put this right underneath the... Okay. Because I got a gel eyeliner in a boxy charm that I really liked. And so I wanted a darker version of that forest, a black, like almost black. This is, um, what color is this? It's called No Shame. And I think once you put this on, you should be able to smoke that out. Oh, yeah. That smokes out pretty much. So, somebody whose name is not as English sent me a friend request. Che, call me back when your name is in English. All right, so that is it for my mini haul today. Um, Once again, I am approaching hair hell. My hair. My hair. My hair. So... Uh, this weekend, I'm going to see if there can be a change up. It probably will still be like an ombre blonde situation, but it will definitely be something new that I haven't done for a while. So I'm looking forward to that and debuting that on the channel. I'm going to not going to make any promises. I'm going to try to do two reality show reviews for the rest of the summer to push out some more content. Um, so I'm gonna try and do Love and Listings, which is a new show, I don't know what it's about, but um, we will figure that out together. And then um, I will try and cover this uh, season of Love and Hip Hop Hollywood. Um, so that is all I have for this evening. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you have a favorite of anything. Um, that you saw me swatch um, today or you have any questions um, drop it down in the comments follow me on the, the medias the social medias on the interwebs um, especially on the IG because if I um, am successful with this uh -huh honey palette and this stark white um, as a shadow base and come out with a decent look there will be pictures on my social media um, I am by no means, let me say this again, I am by no means a makeup artist. I'm just a girl who likes to play in makeup. And so, but if I come out with something that I am proud to share, there will be pic Oh. There will be pictures on my social media. Um There may or may not be a filter on it. I don't know. It depends. Or how I'm feeling about my, my self-esteem that day. So, um, like I was saying, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace.